Hello everyone, welcome back to Mastering Mayhem. Today I have with me the Musu two gallon wet dry vacuum cleaner. It is cordless and I, I believe the battery that it comes with is a five amp hour battery. So what I wanna do is unbox this and demonstrate this. Uh, we'll just go to my truck and vacuum up the driver's side foot area. And then we will vacuum up the debris from cutting iron and wood uh, right here on the shed floor. We're gonna put this guy to test, see what it can do. And if we can, we will run the battery, see how much time it gives us before it runs out. Thanks again for joining us. Let's do this. All right, let's see what we have inside here. That's pretty much it right there. Very, very well protected. But let's go ahead and see what's inside here. Okay, very, very weighty. Nice filter here, wow. And this guy has some weight to it. Very well constructed. Battery compartment there. It's the cordless wet dry vac L10 plus rated voltage 18 volt 200 watts. So that's that's the top portion there, and it does have a low and a high option there. It's nice to have those options. We're just gonna put this upside down. You get your your battery, and to me it looks like a five amper. Let's see, 36 watt hour, secondary lithium lithium ion rechargeable. Uh, same model LT10 plus battery output 18 volt 200 milliamps. Adapter output, direct current 21 volt, 500 milliamps. So that gives you an idea on the battery. It does not have like the uh, bar indicator so you know exactly what the charge of the battery is. So you charge it with this guy and you plug it in right there. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, and this is how it works with the charger here. You plug it in and the adapter has the indicator there if your battery is fully charged or not. When it's fully charged, it'll go green. Okay, now as you can see here, the battery is fully charged. We've got the green LED on the AC adapter. All right, let's see what else comes in the bag. You got your hose adapter here. You have a wide adapter here, a wide suction uh, adapter here. Tight space adapter there. Definitely need that for your car. Absolutely. Looks like you get a shoulder strap that comes with that as well. And then, of course, operating instructions and your activate your warranty online and get a gift. So that's it. That's what you get. So let's just go drop that in place. Nice, nicely put there. And then it looks like, from what I can tell, yeah, it's got a blower as well there. Got these arrows, so in and out is what I'm understanding here. We'll have to check that out and see how that does. It doesn't really lock into place. Okay, it's like it pops into place. Boom, just like that. One and two, just like that. I like this so far. First impression, nice. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much how it works right there, y'all. That's actually pretty loose. So it's locked down, but pretty loose right there. You got your power button here. So another thing that's pretty cool right here is this wide attachment. It just locks into place right here. It's pretty sweet. Yeah, look at that. So you have the attachment with you at all times. Okay, and then you got the cone one there. So this just attaches right on top of there if you ever want to use this one. Nice carrying handle, nice uh, little rubber grip at the top there. This, uh, the power button has three positions, uh, but basically you push it once, it's on low power, you push it twice, it's on high power, and then you push it a third time, it turns it off, and we'll actually check that out. And you have a, an indicator here at the top of the shop back that tells you whether it's on low and high too. You have the also the brushed uh, attachment here as well. So that's pretty cool. As far as the shoulder strap, you just hook them right here, this little gridded area. You can adjust the strap and you can put it all over your shoulder. And double it over like that. So you have it ready to go. You can carry it with you, do your job, get things vacuumed up, and then just take it off. So nice little setup there for this Musu two gallon wet dry vac. Okay, so now we have the battery fully charged. You flip this hard cover up and then it, the battery slides down on upside down, I believe. Just like that, okay. Let me just show you the indicators here. See that? Hi. So there you go. 
Uh, it's not very heavy at all, actually, with the battery and everything. Uh, let's weigh it and see. That's what we have for the total, 7 pounds, 0.6 ounces. And that's with the strap and everything attached, battery and all. All right, I'm just curious to see what kind of what kind of batteries they got in this uh, Musu battery pack. Let's see what, you know, the 18650s, 21700. It says in their advertisement that it gets 30 minutes of runtime on high. And I, from my experience uh, vacuuming, it felt like 30, 30 plus minutes. Let's see if we can take this thing apart. That's all that's in there. It does it definitely spring loaded. All right. It has the clip there. But yeah, definitely it looks like 10 batteries. INR 18650P. So it is the 18650s. It's not the 21700s. There you go. Those are 10 of those batteries in this battery pack. Just thought I'd share that info with you. And the battery's back in working order. All right. It's a good battery. I think it just takes way too long to recharge it. We're going to plug the battery in and then start the timer and see how, how long it takes to charge this battery. Here we go. Plugged in. It's a red light. Of course, it goes right in. And we are going to start 